Peace be upon you. In this video, we present a scientific miracle of the Holy Quran, the pairs of matter. In 1928, the modern theory of antimatter was introduced by the English theoretical physicist Paul Adrian Maurice Dirac, born 1902, died 1984, who predicted the possibility of the existence of anti electrons. In 1932, the American physicist Carl David Anderson, born 1905, died 1991, discovered the anti-electrons and called them positrons. Antimatter has an opposite electric charge to its matter counterpart. For example, protons have a positive electric charge, their antimatter counterparts, called antiprotons, have a negative electric charge. Similarly, electrons, with a negative electric charge, have anti-electrons, known as positrons, with a positive electric charge. These antimatter elementary particles can be used to make antimatter atoms in the laboratory. Although antimatter particles can be generated in a laboratory, they do exist in nature. For example, anti-electrons can be found in the lightning phenomenon. Antimatter particles exist in nature at a small scale, but after they react with their counterparts, they disappear. They constantly fall to Earth from space in the form of energetic particles and cosmic rays. Scientists have reported that antimatter is produced during thunderstorms that are accompanied by lightning and heavy rain. More than 1,400 years ago, the Holy Quran mentioned that all matter is created in pairs, indicating the existence of antimatter. Chapter 51, verse 49, And of everything we have created pairs that you may be mindful. This verse indicates that everything is created in pairs, including matters and atoms which consist of the three basic subatomic components, protons, electrons and neutrons. In another verse, Allah Almighty refers to the creation of humans, animals, plants and other things that we do not know, in pairs. Chapter 36, verse 36, Glory be to him who created pairs of all things, of what the earth grows, and of their kind and of what they do not know. Thank you for watching this video.